What's going on, people? Troops TV, back again. Back our blood clock again, you understand? Obviously, you get me. You look probably been looking like, yo, blood. Why ain't Troops done no announcement on rice, blood? You get me? Like, that's his guy, bro. You understand? Like, the time has come, blood. You understand? Like Cena said, blood, the time is now, blood. You understand? Declan Rice, ladies and gentlemen, has signed for Arsenal Football Club um, officially. It's a done deal, blood. You understand? Deckers, Dexter, my dog. You understand? Um, the DMs are being replied to again. You understand? Um, I see certain man moving salty on Twitter. You get me? About, oh, if you don't screenshot the DM, then it's, it's, it's cap. Brother, why do you think these footballers talk to me, blood? Because I don't expose what goes on in the chat, blood. You understand? That's what we do. You get me? We keep it trill. You get me? Whatever's said behind closed doors. Is kept behind closed doors, blood. You get me? Do you think I'm some gyal that they send in the rave to flipping do fuckery to the footballers and then sell a story to the scum paper or the daily shit? That's not me, blood. You understand? Act like a waste man. That's not me. You get me? So, you understand? Hold that to the haters and stay more salty, blood. You understand? Maybe be like me and then maybe the players will talk to you, blood. You feel me? But back to the announcement video, blood. My brother... Declan Rice has signed for the Arsenal. Um, it is said to be a five-year contract with an option of a year, blood. You understand? Now, Rice is getting that death row contract. You get me? I'm, I'm very happy about that, blood. You understand? Um, tying him down for, for that amount of time. That, that, yeah, me, blood. That is a very good, good deal. Um, obviously, you lot already know he's 24 years old. You understand? He's made 245 appearances um, in the Premier League. Um, also has 43 caps for England. Um, you lot also know that he started his youth career at Chelsea. Um, him and Eddie were actually released at the same time. Eddie was picked up by the Arsenal. Dex went to Chadwell Heath, aka West Ham Academy, and done his ting. And you get me, bro. He had his um, debut game at the end of the 2016-2017 season, which was, funnily enough, our last season in the Champions League, blood. You get me? He came off the bench made his debut for West Ham. And now that we're back in the Champions League, Dex is in the club, blood. You understand? So it's 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 kind of it's kind of fitting, bro. You get me? And obviously people have, have come out and spoken um on the deal. You understand? Edu, you get me, bro. I have to big him up, blood. You understand? I want more though, blood. You get me? I do want more because you get me, we're gonna talk about a certain individual after this um part of the video. You get me, bro? So I need to go. I need, I need more activity. But Edu has spoken and Edu has said, Declan is a player with fantastic ability and a proven record at both club and international level. The process of this transfer has been a big team effort with a clear plan. And we are so happy that Declan is joining us. Declan is high quality. Um, sorry, Declan is a high quality young international player who will add great strength to our squad, fitting so well into our strategy strategy of competing with young, talented players at our club. It's great that Declan will be joining up with Mikel, our coaches and his new teammates in good time ahead of the new season. Obviously, uh, the manager, Mikel Arteta, has also had his say and Arteta has said, we're really happy that Declan is joining us. He's a player with tremendous ability who has been performing at a high level in the Premier League and for England for a number of seasons now. Declan is bringing undoubted quality to the club and he is an exceptional talent who has the potential to be very, success blah, very successful here. Uh, Declan has great experience in the Premier League at only 24 years old. He has captained a very good West Ham uh, team and as we all saw, he recently lifted a European trophy. The responsibility and role he has taken on has been very impressive and we are very excited that he is joining us. You understand now? You already know. You get me? He'll, he'll bring leadership to the team as well, bro. You understand? He was made West Ham captain in, in May 2022. And, and you get me, bro? He, he literally ran with it. You get me? Pulled them to um, the Conference League final. He was also, and won it. He was also named player of the tournament in, in that tournament as well, blood. You understand? So he's coming with a lot of clout, a lot of confidence. And obviously the man himself has spoken as well. And Dex has said... 
It's been a bit overwhelming because my relationship with Hes with West Ham, with the love and support I have for them, it's been really hard to walk away. In football, amazing opportunities arise. Big clubs like Arsenal have come in for me and it's really hard to turn down. You only ever get one career and I really believe in what Mikel is building here and the squad he's building. I'm really looking forward to the future with Arsenal. You understand? Now, he's saying the right things. You lot have seen the behind the scene videos. He looks so happy, bro. You get me? He looks like he looks like us. He looks like one of the fans, bro. You get me? How we are so excited now for the upcoming season. You get me? Um, Cronky, Josh, a couple years back, he said, be excited. And now, you get me, bro. It took about three and a half fucking years, but I'm starting to get excited, bro. You get me? The Viagra started to kick in. So that's good, blood. You get me? West Ham have also spoken on him, blood. You get me? Um, the joint chairman of West Ham, David Sullivan, obviously he made a little statement and he said that everyone at West Ham United should be very proud of what, or, or sorry, of the part we have played in his journey from the Academy of Football at Chadwell Heath to becoming the most valuable young player in English football. You get me? So thank you, uh, David Sullivan, for um, giving us Declan Rice and Blood Clark Peas in out of midfield, blood. You understand? Now, you already know the preseason tour has, um, well, preseason started. We drew 1 1 in Nuremberg. Um, good first half performance. Second half was, you get me, hella changes. So it was expected. I expected that performance in the second half. A man that had a great first half and I thought looked very good was Thomas Partey. Now, Thomas has not been included in the squad traveling over um, to America. I'm going to give you the squad in full jet ski. Bow. There you go, people. Uh, Ramsdale, Saliba, Tierney, Benny Blanco, Gabriel, Saka, Odegaard, Jesus, Martinelli, Timba, Renarsson, Inketia, Kiwio, Holden, Tomiyasu, Trossard, Jorginho, Fabio Vieira, Elneny, Balogun, Marquinhos, Havertz, Carl Hein, Austin Trusty has made his way in, um, Zinchenko, Dex, and Amario Cozier Dubri. Now, no place for Ethan Nawari as well. He had a great cameo performance coming off the bench. Um, it looks like he will be going to Spain with the rest of the only 21 members who didn't make it. Man, like Walters didn't make it as well, blood. So I think they'll be going to Spain for an only 21 um, pre-season tour. But Thomas Partey, blood, you understand? Um, he has been left out of the squad, blood. You get me? There's been rumours that um, he has uh, commit. He is committed to a move to a Saudi Arabian club. Um, obviously, Juventus are um, interested in the, in the midfielder as well. Now, for me, you don't sell him, blood. You get me? Um, you don't sell him. People are saying that He's going to fly out next week with um, Smith Rowe. Obviously, Smith Rowe's away having a little break after doing up a madness in the under-21 uh, championships. So I get Smith Rowe putting up a week late. But the Partey one is kind of worrying me, blood. You get me, Bakar? If you look at what we have now, yeah, Rice, Partey, Odegaard is a dangerous midfield. That is cold, bro. You get me? People will fear that midfield. People will respect that midfield. That midfield could do bits in the Champions League, bro. That midfield could do bits in the Premier League, bro. You get me? The experience. Partey was probably top two, top three guaranteed DMs in the Premier League last year, blood. I do not understand why we are, um, why that, you get me? If, if, if we are to sell him, why we are doing this, bro. It's, it's a very stupid decision. I don't think we should be doing it, especially when you've let Xhaka go out the door. You understand? Like, it doesn't make sense, bro. You get me? Keep Partey for a season and then you can let him go, blood. You get me? Because... What are we going to do? Are we going to go in to get Lavia? You understand? Are we going to go back in for Casado? I don't think we're going back in for Casado because they're going to ask stupid money now because of what because of what we paid for Dex. You understand? So Lavia is the only option. Is 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 that the right decision at this moment in time? Lavia is going to be a bad boy in years to come. But right now, with what is going on, you're basically like taking it's basically one step forward and two step backwards. You get me? That, that, that's what in my opinion, isn't it? So we're going to keep our eyes on the, on the parte situation, but. Yeah, man, you lot let me know your thoughts on the Declan Rice signing. Let me know your thoughts on the um, Thomas Partey situation as well, blood. You get me? Is there any people that you wanted to see in the squad for the USA Tour? Any people that shouldn't be in the squad? Um, obviously, Cedric is not in the squad, uh, but uh, there are other certain people in the squad who they really and truly, Richard and Judy, shouldn't be in the blood clot squad, blood. You get me? But you lot let me know in the comments below like share comment and subscribe once again welcome to the arsenal 
Declan Rice and Blood Clark Peas. It's your boy Troops. And we're out. <laughs>